B. So she got a three, two, three. How at your girl goes? Cause I'm talking body to body, cheek to cheek. Happy Saturday, such so a goddess crew. I love you guys. Thanks for being like, subscribing, and sharing. And when you get a chance, I'm saying hit that notification button down below so you're notified when I post my videos. Cause I'm gonna need you guys to be kept up with this energy. The energy, if it resonates, it resonates. Um, I, I, so I did a little shuffle this morning. Definitely picked up a little bit of the karmic energy very angry upset karmic like get your life get your life i don't even know this karmic's mad because intuitively so this is an intuitive karmic which divine masculine feminine energy energy if res resonates intuitively they know divine masculine's coming to solidify a connection with you so that they feel it they know it's like i can feel it in the air they can feel it in the air so energy energy if res resonates so don't forget to check out my shorts guys also your divine masculine knew that this connection was worth waiting for. They feel in regret about even going towards this karmic. See, I believe in the beginning, your person, they were getting intuitive. Okay, I can't say downloads because they weren't really in tune to their spirituality. But they were getting signs that said, listen, this is a super duper red flag. Wait, you know I'm saying being in low vibrational, being in the flesh filling purposes, this person decided to take a risk. Okay, and then the, in the process of taking the risk, lost you in the process to this karmic person. Okay. This way, Masca knew that you would ride for him till the end of time. I'm hearing this way, Masca said, you'll ride for me till the end of time. You were this person's anchor, okay? They knew that they could count on you, solidify you, anything that you want to do. Oh my God, my nose is running. Okay, anything that you want to do, you were down for this person, okay? I'm getting like, and you communicated that a lot enough. This person knew that, okay? This person also knew that you embodied a lot of abundance when it came to connection. Almost like you're very stable and firm in your connection, okay? And then by masking somehow, you know what I'm saying? I feel like the snake was literally sent to deter the path of your connection, but also like a lesson for your person, okay? Because the karmic snaked them at the end. This person, I can't stand though. This person put this karmic on a pedestal at some point, okay? Like thinking they were their queen and everything. This karma got lots of dark secrets, lots of things hitting from Divine Masculine. Very unstable mentally, physically, and emotionally. And Divine Masculine's like, damn, all I did, look, this is a middle card worth waiting for. Divine timing plays a, play, is at risk in your, as, at, divine timing is at work in your love life. This person realizing that spirit literally, every time you ask for what you want, spirit will send you a distraction to keep you on the path to see if that's what you really want so you gotta pay attention that's where karmic energy comes from guys so this person they're like damn i done fucked up now so they feel bad for that okay they feel bad for it's like they feel bad for skipping you a spirit saying like this person feels like i feel like at some point they said no i don't want to be in a solidified connection with you i don't want this type of connection picking up the energy from yesterday but then went and and did that with someone else and got burned and like literally i'm talking stds and everything like got burned spirit made sure that this person this karmic person literally gave this person run for their money literally gave this person you know i'm gonna give you what you asked for okay you you want to play with fire you're gonna get burned and this person regrets that the whole time because they know that you were just like not waiting and not just around waiting but like literally waiting say listen I'm giving you some time to get yourself together. I told you I'm going to ride with you. I'm going to be here by your side no matter what with the green and the blue. I feel like you communicated a lot to this person about your feelings, how you felt for them, okay? Do you got me? You want this? You know what I'm saying? And you you gave your person. So what the energy I'm picking up also is that you literally told your person, I'll ride for you. Would you ride for me? Uh, I know that some old school song. Would you ride for me? And your person, like, I don't want that. All that like, you know what I'm saying? And then Spirit said, all right, you don't want me to give you someone that's good for you for your life? I'm going to give you somebody that's going to tear your shit up. Energy to energy, if resonates. So this person needs to learn to pay attention to spirit to gain balance in their life. So energy to energy, if it resonates. So I'm going to pull some tarot cards. I actually have these ones here at the top that I had during my short. So I'm going to use these, okay? I love you guys. Hope you guys have a great day. See, I started to read off without tarot cards. I looked at some, but I, the downloads that I got weren't from the tarot cards, okay? Look at the wheel card. Wondering, can they come in and take another chance? This person really loves you. So they're wondering, like, would you still ride for me? Would you ride for me, huh? Would you ride for me? This person wants to know, like, would you still ride for me after all the things that I put you through? After all the things? Yeah, look at King of Wands. Because I was indecisive, Two of Wands, but now I made a final decision. You hold the key to my heart. So I'm, like, wondering, will you, will you be with me? Gemini energy. Look at the Eight of Cups. Gemini moon tonight, baby. Happy, happy full moon in Gemini, okay? So this person literally is walking away from that connection. Like, they're done, okay? You, you were saying your person's life to help them overcome lots of things. Okay, also, lots of telepathic messages between you two. Listen for songs, okay? Your person sending you messages through songs, okay? So when your person 
when okay so this is going fast okay you're a person they were indecisive in this energy but when you left their life they started getting more intuitive signs about being with you you know what this person too when they're of this karmic in this karmic situation this karmic connection with this low vibrational person they never felt freedom they always felt like they were stuck like like this person kept super tabs on your person they never gave them the freedom that they wanted and this isn't about like being able to do what you want to do but this karmic didn't trust the divine masculine feminine energy energy if it was right they didn't trust them and that was another thing that the divine masculine didn't like was the fact that like what like what is it nothing happened for this karmic not to trust him and i feel like because the karmic was sneaking around with other people and Divine Masculine was picking up on that energy. Look at, I told you, sneaking around with other people, 544 in the clock. Divine Masculine started picking up on that too. So this Divine Masculine started picking up on the fact that the karmic was out with other people. He said, oh, hell no. I literally left my connection with a twin flame soulmate, okay? I feel like they, at the time, they didn't know that. I left this connection. This very, okay, so they knew it was a close connection. They knew, it, look at, they knew it was a divine connection, some type of way, spiritual connection. It was just different, okay? They knew that, and they were keeping all types of secrets and things from you. It was the way you made this person feel when they were present, and they said, oh, hell no, you had me leave a divine connection to come with this, fuck shit. Energy to energy, if it resonates, resonates, okay? Hell no. What did I do? It's like your person started like a re... It's like they were in healing energy and they went with this person and they had to start all over again. And they were not happy about that. They were not happy about the fact that starting... It's like they feel like they had to start their journey all over again. Their money was getting tied into stuff. Their emotions... They were very emotionless with this karmic person, okay? Despite whatever they said, whatever you think, there was no emotions in this. This person literally was like in and out of this person's life. You think they were in and out of your life? They literally out of the, in and out of this person's life. Literally, they got what they got want and just left. Look at moving on. And you know what? This person, they started feeling bad for doing that too. But hey, energy to energy, if it resonates, it resonates, okay? Look at five of cups, Okay. Moving away, your person's like, nah, I can't do this. I got to go back to my twin flame soulmate, my divine connection, my deepened bond, whatever. However they said at the time, they're like, no, I have to do this. I can't, like, I can't. They said I can't. The other person literally started looking at the karmic person, like, no. They will look at them, think about you, no, okay? This person, Spirit, can you clarify something for me? Yeah, Queen of Wands in the star card. This person, they weren't even, like, attracted to this karmic person, okay? They didn't think they were beautiful. They, It was just, like, more for what they can... I'm picking up more of what they can get out of this connection. But look at... Because I kept thinking about you was another reason. Like, what's the point of me being here? Because I could think that. That's another thing, too. Like, if I'm going to go out and be with someone and date and try to understand someone, I have to, like, literally be over the my last connection. Because how unfair is it to be with someone and think about someone else? Such I got to do to do. Your person, there was, like, no love no love no love no there was no love because they kept thinking about you and the things that they want to do with you and like why they didn't there's they start looking at this karmic like why didn't i give my person the love offer like what like what what and that's when they started realizing you know what everything happens for a reason and spirit did this for a reason okay spirit did it for a reason truth is i know why because i wish i wanted something so bad that i got sent a distraction to see how bad i wanted and i deterred off the path and i don't like that okay so they want to can we get right knight of wands i want to go back i want to figure out how i can get back to my person here's leo sagittarius energy like i don't want to do that that close page of swords five of swords the empress how am i going to come back to my person what do i got to do like like, I already caused all this conflict, all this all this fighting, all this manipulation. So your person, like, trying to figure, like, what could I come back to be with my empress? I'm telling you, this person wants to get you pregnant so bad. It's, like, unbelievable. Okay? Because they end this connection. They end it with the karmic. They're like, I don't know. How do I get myself out of these web lives? But I think spirit's going to hold off on the pregnancy when it comes to you and your connection. Because I think this person has a lot of more work to do. Yeah. Spirit said, I'm going to hold off on that. Because it would be a heavy burden. So if you weren't to get pregnant by a person or something. Or they said something about pregnancy. Spirit's holding off on that. Because you guys have a lot more work to do together. Mostly. I'm picking up mostly of your person. Yeah. A lot of more work. Seven of Pentacles, seven of coins, 77, baby, okay? Your person has to clear up some things in their life. This has nothing to do with having other options, okay? But there's things in their life that they need to clear up, like blockages and everything like that, okay? And there may be somebody still trying to be in this person's energy. I'm picking up like a karmic person. Although this Divine Masculine doesn't deal with this karmic, I feel like this karmic start, tries to be in Divine Masculine some type of way, like some type of way. 
yeah temperance ten of cups because they they see them work so your persons are becoming a different person while they're in this karmic connection okay and the karmic re started realizing your person started working on their self 10 one on the clock they're like they knew your person intuitively guided was becoming a better person they're like oh you didn't so it must have been the way your person talks and stuff like that they started acting really different they're like oh well you don't do that you didn't act like that you didn't talk like that because your person was like trying to move away from this connection they literally if they slept together or was in the same room your person like literally didn't stay they they and if they did stay they kept their back turned to the karma all night because they were really, really wondering like why did i put myself in this connection how do i get myself out of it seven of wands how do i get myself out of it on the seventh seven 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 this is not where i want to be this is not where my luck is this is where not my abundance is i don't want this conflict i don't even want this connection what am i doing i don't even want this connection what am i doing this is not even fair to my person that stayed there and waited for me and was like in vain in his balance. I left this balanced ass connection for this imbalanced, unstable ass person. Like why? Like why would I do that? My person's totally worth waiting for. Look at this. I can't make this shit up. Yeah, with the Ace of Ace of Cups, Ace of Pentacles, and Six of Wands. I'm I'm gonna go move on to where like Six of Wands and Cherry Card left done out the door it was 11 11 o'clock done intuition i love it i love it my person okay but like why am i doing this i don't even have no emotion for this karma i don't even have any feelings for this karma like what was i thinking okay you were thinking you were being in low vibrational and they realized that sunshine guy is three two three deck clothes i realized like this is not where i want to be this is not what i need to do started learning about twin flame so my connections realized i need to change my life like because this ain't where it at this is not where it's at yeah sexuality i'm telling you your person did not like having sex with this karmic magic okay i feel like the karmic tried to do some type of sex magic on the masculine in it like it worked for a second it can't stop and then it just wore off okay it worked for a second creativity sunstone determination okay she was determined to keep it by masculine he was determined to get out of this connection so she tried a little sex magic you know a little kitchen magic but it did not work what it did was push by masculine to divine feminine for a new beginning he was starting to think like nah i don't want this connection i'm straight on this i don't want it okay sociability this karmic also like wanted to use divine masculine as like being in a social setting okay like almost like this karmic thought it this karmic if your your person was like a well-known popular person everyone knows about them or knows them they use this connection the karmic uses connection as to like game stardom fame but spirit was like no everyone knew this karmic was like not as, this karmic like to try to act like they were so pure everyone knew this karmic was not like this they weren't even compassionate like no that's what another thing that my masculine didn't like about that is this karmic wasn't so much of a good person like they thought in the beginning they thought this oh look at this guys who, who who's this peeking in my window nobody because i live in a penthouse divine feminine energy i told you this karmic was not compassionate okay so my message like you don't nurture me you don't heal my soul you don't just look at them like you don't do nothing for me i gotta go i need to find the courage to do things i want with the strength from my higher power of the courage to overcome any challenges and that would have been leaving this karmic's ass alone i'm telling you there's they like they did threesomes and shit and that's like the karmic thought they were like oh i did threesomes with my divine masculine and he was just using them okay and the growing stronger spiritually 13 26 seven o'clock i know from a 16 to a 26 baby growing spiritually i'm connected to my spiritual growth as i raise my consciousness i become a source of light to the world transforming becoming a better person for this new beginning i don't like care about this karmic person i don't want to be with them what i see is i need to come in and be with you from a higher perspective i realize there's no accident that we attract everything in us through cause and effect and what they tell you this person deviated off the twin flame path and they're like you know what? i gotta go back to my there goes my baby i gotta go back to my person where i need to be okay and you know what this person's inner child issues that they had was was another reason that they went to this yeah inner truth forgiveness they didn't forgive themselves for something that happened to them when they were younger as an inner child which pushed them into being in this low vibrational comfortable ass energy like they didn't know no better but spirit did it on divine timing for them to grow for you to grow even for the karmic like everybody just had to get to where it's like i just need everybody to get themselves together like be better 
trust in yourself trust in me trust in your decisions but don't go against the grain of when i tell you to do something or what you know is better because angel blessings i'm not gonna keep sending you something you keep messing it up spirit saying i'm not gonna keep sending you something you keep messing up you gotta cherish what i send you you asked for it from 14 44 in the clock did you not ask for it? my outer words reflection of what's within i am mindful that my thoughts and words shape my reality this person's like all right i'm not gonna ask for a little vibrational I'm not going to deal with stuff like that no more, okay? I'm going to change my way of thinking so it could change my life. Sunshine Guide is 333. I love you guys. Yeah, perseverance. Pushing forward. When I start a project, I have the perseverance and endurance to see it through. Saying, and why did I start this connection with someone and I never even, like, saw it through? I never really did been there for them like I was supposed to. My wish fulfillment, okay? Healing their inner chakras. So, guys, I'm using my special cards that are so strong. They give me, like, a headache as soon as they instantly pull them out so strong okay so let's see what we got i'm taking middle messages for energy from your person okay so i can have a card to clarify these messages Ooh, four came out eight eight eight's a number your person looks at you like abundance okay what's really good for your soul talk body to body cheek to cheek so for more and i've been through the worst i can overcome anything so your person's like listen i'm i'm really ready to to change my life i want to leave this situation redone redo over okay this was well planned i'm glad it's worth waiting for so your person's like you know if i didn't go through this karmic stuff right now it would take me so long to overcome these things so like it's better and it was worth waiting for you are worth waiting for for your person it's better that everything happened the way it was so your person can see People, situations, and not only that, themselves for who they are. Sunshine God is 333. And your person wants to say thanks for being you, for giving them encouragement, for them being a better person. Sunshine God is 333. I love you guys. Happy Saturdays. Okay, keep your head up in your heart close. God, happy full moon and Gemini baby. Okay, a little secret. Come close, come close. Maybe I can do a 15 minute for you, but that's it. I love you guys. Keep your head up in your heart close. God, and I'll catch you in my midday mix. Our next treat, whatever comes first. Mwah.